Zara Dennis Lackenby Brown and David Salako met the rest of the Love Island contestants on Thursday after picking two lucky islanders to go on dates with on Wednesday. However, their arrival wasn't the only thing distracting ITV viewers as fans commented on the one problem with the girls' outfits. The Love Island girls were looking stunning on Thursday as they welcomed the two new arrivals. But, some fans noticed some of the girls were guilty of a supposed fashion faux pas. As the Islanders continued to get to know each other, viewers spotted stickers on the girls' shoes. Walters underscore son tweeted, Lana, are you going to be returning those heels when you get home? You've left the stickers on them, hope you held on to the receipt. Hashtag Love Island. Really hurting my soul that the girls have stickers under their heels. Hashtag Love Island, 1994 Nyas added. Izzy Care Brown agreed, at Ma Yajama PLS PLS can you have a word and tell the girls to take the stickers off their heels. It's triggering my OCD 20 hashtag Love Island. Is there a reason all the girls have still got the stickers on the bottom of their heels? Hashtag Love Island, Imi Elmer question. Angelica Pickles wrote, Why has not one girl in this villa taken the stickers off the bottom of their shoes? Hashtag Love Island. Becca Hackworth exclaimed, Girls come on. First thing you do with a new pair of shoes is take the BY sticker off. Hashtag Love Island. Zara and David have shown they're both not afraid of ruffling a few feathers in the South African villa. Speaking ahead of their arrival, Zara teased, I'm very loving to a fault, I am a Leo and people often think Leos are arrogant but we're just very self-assured, we love ourselves but we have the same capacity to love other people. I'm very loyal but that means I sometimes put others before myself. But this is Love Island so I'm not going to go in there and let the girls take over because in the past I've been like. If you like him, you have him. I'd be an amazing girlfriend, I'm understanding, caring, fun and sexy. Explaining what would put her off a man, she added, players and if someone's boring and doesn't have any aspirations or ambition. Also guys that aren't into their fitness and health. Opening up on her performing career. Zara revealed she's worked with several well-known artists. She said, I've always loved being on stage and performing, I did musical theater and performing arts at university. I'm fully trained in ballet, tap and jazz and have singing qualifications which led me to get scouted as a model. I've since gone on to do lots of modeling and dancing for music videos for UK and global artists, I've worked with people like Hardy Caprio, Hedy One, H, Tione Wayne and more. Meanwhile, David described himself as a really good judge of character. He continued, I'm very picky, I haven't met the right one yet. The person you're going to meet is never going to be perfect, but I've got my standards. Love Island continues on ITV2 on Friday at 9pm.